Okay, so today is May 10th. Our task for the day is working in the garden. I'm gonna just uh, prepare the strawberry beds a little bit more. I've already weeded them. They were really badly uh, infested with grass and weeds. So I pulled them all out of the two beds. We planted some of the strawberry plants. And Mike, if you wanna just show a couple of these little plants. And then I put straw around them to hopefully keep some of the weeds out. They're looking good. So we have this bed and then we have uh, a compost which is in dire need of re re sir, um, repair. repair. And then this strawberry bed is also ready to go. And then we have two more strawberry beds that are filled with grass and weeds. So they have to be done. And that'll be maybe today, maybe tomorrow. Mike is watering the little bit of garden that has already been planted. We're gonna work on improving this compost pile. So I'm gonna start by digging out all of the grass and uh, turning over the soil, adding some new soil to it, some more dirt and uh, chicken poop. Now that we have chickens, the poop will be perfect for this compost pile. I'll show you the end result. Ready for part two of our repair of the compost. I've gotten all the weeds out. We've measured all the boards. We've put up a couple of old boards, which uh, a friend of us gave, a friend of ours gave us. Now we're putting up uh, the rest that will be on the front and the back. Because we're using some old wood, some new wood, it's always good to have a level. And uh, we want to make sure that at least the front is level with what else is going to, going to be put on. And it looks like it's pretty good. Let's nail it. Mike is just finishing this up by stapling the chicken wire to the boards. And we're all set to go. Well done. So this is 99.9% uh, .9 finished. I'm going to wait and let the, uh, the fresh, new, pressure treated boards uh, weather a bit dry out and then maybe in a month or so maybe the end of the season i don't know i'll paint it but it's ready to go we'll add some new soil and some chicken poop and they'll start and our worms and they'll start decomposing chicken manure added to the compost pile before we put in another layer of soil and that will help to uh, make some really rich compost Okay, one more strawberry bed, fairly weed free. There's still a few left in there. But today I gotta also finish this one. It's a little daunting. I'm sure there are strawberry plants down underneath and I will find them and put them in a safe spot while I'm digging up the rest of the weeds, but it is daunting. But what a good feeling it will be when that's all completed. So I put the, I dig up the, uh, strawberry beds and pull up all the good strawberry plants and put them in a this just happens to be a garbage can lid that has a bunch of water in it keeps them nice and alive and fresh before I can transplant them strawberry bed number three weeded planted fertilized and now we'll add the straw and then work on the last one all right julie finally finished a lot of hard work because they were in rough shape but uh we have these three strawberry uh strawberry beds and then you can't really see it but on the other side of the composting uh, bin there's another one but we're giving them a little water one of the things about raised beds is you got to usually give them a little bit more water than normal and as it as it turns out we think it might rain tonight we're hoping so okay on to the next project